the Bears, Kenny. Uh, they've gotten eight wins or more in each of their last three seasons. They just took Justin Fields. Do you feel like they have what it takes to put together another season and get over seven and a half wins? I sure do, Jesse. This team was an offense away from being one of the best in football last year. That defense was really, really good. And look, they did lose Fuller. We mentioned uh, that he signed with nine, my new favorite quarterback, cornerback trio. But they still have Khalil Mack. They still have Mario Edwards. They bring back Allen Robinson on offense. They should be competitive with, if not better, than the Vikings and the Lions. And I also am, you know, a, 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 a believer in Jared Goff, to, you know, in that new situation. But I still think he stinks. Um, and, I, you know, look, I just think that they're probably the second best team in this division. So they should get some wins inside the division with that good defense. And Justin Fields here, I do think that he should start early on, if not week one. Um, I know that there's people, you know, Adam Kaufman's of the world would say, well, let's just talk about this team like Andy Dalton's a starting quarterback. Dalton's not going to be the starting quarterback for more than two games here. Justin Fields, I believe in him. I think he's a good quarterback. I think he's pro ready. And I think that he will take a, t a team that's really begging for a pro ready quarterback right now to take them to new heights. And I do think that the Bears can get there. I think the Bears will make the playoffs this season. So they'll get over seven and a half wins. All right, Reed, what do you think? Over seven and a half wins? Yeah, Adam Kaufman also doesn't know that the Bears traded up to get Justin Fields, not to sit him down on, you know, ride pine behind Andy Dalton. What are they going to get from Andy Dalton? Absolutely nothing. Um, and that's why, like, you know, the, your, your social media team has to change their QB1 post to Justin Fields already. And I, I think, it, you know, when you take a look at what, what they did in the draft, not only what they did also in free agency, bolstering up their offense, Kenny, is Justin Fields was great but take a look at the other oklahoma state they're they're, they're the, the tap from oklahoma state jenkins i think that was a big signing for the bears as well especially with someone that's going to need a lot of protection like justin fields as a rookie quarterback even if it's Andy dalton for a game or two